Welcome to JSA TV, live from PTC 23, the newsroom for tech, telecom, and data center professionals. I'm Buffy Harakitis, and joining me today is John Greenwood, SVP of Corporate Strategy for Lincoln Rackhouse. John, welcome to JSA TV. Thank you. Appreciate the partnership with JSA. Yeah, we appreciate it as well. Is uh, this your first time here at PTC? Uh, no, we, we come every year. But okay. yeah, so it's it's an annual event. So what do you think about this year? Bigger than ever, huh? Bigger than ever. Yeah, it's been yeah, great. It's definitely very productive. the best BT PTC ever uh, here in sunny Honolulu, Hawaii. And uh, so glad to have you here you. on yeah. JSA TV. So for viewers that might not already know, but I'm sure many of them already do. Can you tell us a little bit more about Lincoln Rackhouse? Yeah, so Lincoln Rackhouse is the data center division of Lincoln Property Company. Lincoln Property Company is was established in 1965, has 8,000 employees, about 80 billion in assets under management. It's one of the largest and, and most respected real estate firms in the US. And so we're, we're building out a mission critical data center practice underneath that umbrella. But the good thing about that is that Lincoln has invested heavily in mm -hmm. industrial side as well. And there is a strategy to combine in certain markets, data center and industrial together uh, for speed of delivery and, and access to new, to new markets quicker. Yeah, speed is everything now in today's data center market for sure. Absolutely. Yeah, and you recently joined uh, Lincoln Rackhouse uh, among several other executives, executives there. Mm -hmm. uh, why don't you tell us a little bit more about your role and what you yeah. plan to do for Lincoln Rackhouse? Yeah, so we're very focused on the next phase of growth for Lincoln Rackhouse. I'd, I'd break it into three categories. One is acquisition. Okay. acquisition of land to continue to build out data center hyperscale campuses but also acquisitions of companies to round out our portfolio of services and capabilities and build scale the second part of that is a build to suit capability okay. um, that, that we can perform for clients really anywhere in the world because of our access to capital and then the third part is an existing portfolio of data centers with really immediate inventory that's ready to go. So we operate in Dallas, Kansas City, Atlanta, Silver Spring, Maryland, and London. And in each one of those data centers, we have multiple megawatts that's that's ready to go, moving ready tomorrow. And in today's era of supply chain headwinds and uh, constrained capacity, it's, it's an advantage for us to have that type of immediate inventory ready to go. Well, that's definitely an advantage uh, yeah. in today's market yeah. for sure. Uh, why don't you tell us a little bit more about a recent development in Ohio? Yeah, so we are partnered with Harrison Street on oh, okay. in a, in a uh, tract of land, 190 acres outside of Columbus in New Albany. And uh, we're currently underway um, building a 300 MBA substation. Well, first tranche of capacity will be available later in 2024. But we're really excited about that market. It is one of the top internet cloud operation markets in the world. It is, yes. And um, and so we're we're having, I mean, at at the event today, we're, a lot of conversations about partnering with various companies and and having good conversations with end user hyperscale companies on on that on that land and on the property. And we're just real excited about New Albany. Yeah, it sounds very exciting, especially in in today's market where. Uh, that region is definitely booming and mm -hmm. you're seeing more hyperscale growth and uh, more digital transformation across many different verticals and organizations there in that Ohio market. Um, but aside from Ohio, yeah. there's been some activity for Lincoln Rackhouse in Atlanta. Atlanta. Yeah, yeah that's right. Atlanta. Tell us a little bit. That's right. Yeah. So that's that. another really attractive market that's growing rapidly. And we uh, we made an acquisition of an existing site. It has five megawatts that's that's ready to go, but we're also it's on a campus, so we're gonna we're gonna continue to build out that campus. Okay. Phase two is what we're calling it, and that'll have uh, another ten to twelve megawatts of capacity that we that we add to it. But we're we're bullish on Atlanta as well, and and uh, we'll continue to invest in that market. For sure. Well, it sounds like 2023 is off to a great start, really uh, especially having you as the uh, corporate strategist there. Yeah. Uh, so congratulations on your role. Thank you. 
uh, with Lincoln Rack House, and we wish you uh, much success. We're so happy to have you here at yeah. PTC and, of course, as a JSA partner. Uh, so is there anything else that you wanted to add? Uh, no, I, th I think, well, yes, Lincoln Rackhouse, I think, is, is poised extremely well as we look as we look at our 10-year plan and look down the road at what we're capable of doing, you know, inside this umbrella of Lincoln Property mm -hmm. Company. So I, I'm excited to make some more announcements in the, uh, in the months and years ahead of, of, of growth. So we're, we're really excited about it. So viewers should stay tuned for yeah. many more announcements coming uh, in 2023 and beyond yep. uh, from Lincoln Rackhouse. So, John, thanks Thank again you. for joining us. Uh, where can viewers go to find more and stay tuned for some of those upcoming announcements? Yeah, just LincolnRackhouse.com. LincolnRackhouse.com, Twitter, LinkedIn. LinkedIn, Twitter, all of the above. So be sure to follow Lincoln Rackhouse on all of the above, uh, LinkedIn, Twitter, and LincolnRackhouse.com. And thank you, viewers, for tuning in to another fabulous episode of JSA TV from PTC 23 in sunny Honolulu, Hawaii. Happy networking. Thank you. <laughs>